was actually walking out of work um, when I heard when I heard it yesterday, just at one o'clock. And um, as I was walking out the door, I was saying yes, and um, you know, I was excited about it and very honored, you know, to to have this position. And you know, I have a lot of investment in the in the program, and not just in the high school program, but also with the youth hockey too as well. And I look forward to um, working with youth hockey throughout the season and uh, throughout the years. So. I'm real excited about it. You know, I mean, there's a lot of things, you know, just uh, organizational things and, uh, you know, how to manage uh, certain lines and, you know, how to put combos together and stuff and things that you're looking for uh, in kids. But, you know, I've known Wade for a long time. Uh, his father and I used to uh, do hockey camp together and be co-coaches sometimes. So I've known Wade since he's been a little kid at hockey camp and um, nothing but a lot of respect for him. Um, he did a great job with this program. Uh, the, the foundation was built many years ago, and he came in here and knocked up a few more walls on that foundation. And so um, I just want to kind of carry on what, uh, what he started and uh, continue on what's been done and just, uh, you know, keep moving forward. Yeah, I have. Yeah, I've gotten some text messages, and I've also ran into some guys uh, too yeah, as well. And so, you know, right now it's still fresh, you know, and uh, I, I've already had a couple uh, phone conversations with some coaches uh, throughout the, the state here and so just trying to finalize schedules and things like that and move things around if we can and you know but it's just that you know it's really it's really fun it's uh, I'll tell you right from the start um, it's just been really a uh, go 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 so I'm excited you know I, I've been around lumberjack hockey for a while I did coach for a while back from 97 to the early 2000s so and, and then I've been back now for about six years so being behind the bench I'm not worried about any of that bench management stuff anything like that um, I know that our kids are going to be, be prepared um, every game to play and so um, I'm just excited to get moving forward here and uh, look forward to meeting with all the kids and uh, getting things started for the summer. It's really huge uh, my brother played here back in the early 80s too as well so um, and he was here through like the mid 80s so I heard a lot of uh, you know those guys back in the day when they went to the state tournament uh, that was like uh, you know 29 years ago when we first went a few years ago so um, you know I got to hear a lot about those guys and uh, you know to me they were kind of legends as I would hear from my brother you know some of those guys and so to come up here play at BSU get to kind of know the program and watch them because they did play at the same place that we played at so you know, we got to watch them, and when I got done playing uh, college hockey, I just felt like it's a natural fit. Moved right in and uh, got a coaching job here with with the high school, and uh, just kind of ran with it for a while. And I'll tell you, it's it, it's you know, I'm originally from Rochester, Minnesota, but when I came up here, I fell in love with Bemidji, and I've been here for 20 plus years. And uh, when they asked me, where, you know, where do I call home, and this is where I call home. Oh yeah, it's huge. I mean. Minnesota hockey is uh, right up there with uh, Texas football. I mean, it's it's number one, and um, you, you know, in order to you know when you when you get in a position like this, it's you know there's a lot of responsibility. You got uh, 40 guys that you got to look out for, and 40 other kids that aren't yours, but you treat them like they are yours. And um, you know, the the hockey community is a great community. I've uh, some coaches have reached out to me and congratulated me and. Uh, and, um, you know, it's just, it's really good. And I'm just looking forward to getting together with some of those coaches here in the future. No, youth hockey is, um, you know, that's our feeder program to the high school. And those kids spend about eight, eight to nine years in that youth program before they get to us. So I think it's real important for me to, um, you know, come in and help out youth hockey and be a part of uh, making some decisions and making some changes if they have to be some changes and, you know, or, or just sitting down and trying to figure it out. There's a lot of good hockey minds in this community that are part of youth hockey. And so I think if we all just get down collectively, put our heads together, we can figure some things out. And, you know, not only can we pump hockey players out of this town, but we can also pump uh, good men and, and good women too as well.